Hi, Dick Rochford here, aboard uh, 917 Romeo Papa, a 2019 NXI, G1000 NXI equipped Piper M350. It's a beautiful panel, latest and greatest. Romeo Papa, can it mind me? Center on 132.25. Now it's a little bit warm today, ISA plus 12. And in the climb, we're seeing some elevated. Not terrible, but slightly elevated CHTs, particularly the number five. Uh, I know the number five is always the hottest. But we should be able to make a 30, um, 30 gallon an hour climb uh, to, to 10,000 without exceeding uh, 380 or so. And uh, when we set the 30, uh, Back at six or eight thousand feet, uh, we noticed it was already above that 380. So we lessened the climb to 130 knots, which is my preferred climb anyway. Five, seven, six, seven, three, Papa, Papa, two, uh, eight, two, two, zero. It's ice seven, penetration. Nine, one, seven, Romeo, Papa, fly heading out one seven five vector precipitation. Heading one seven five seven Romeo Papa. More seconds. So. So, 673 pop pop 241 descending 220. November 673 pop 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 Miami Center Roger. 130 knots is ice penetration and VA, more or less, and so it's my preferred climb speed. And uh, for the most part, we'll get better than 500 feet a minute. Remember, this is a piston airplane, and so all in due time. But the objective here is to climb and maintain uh, your cruise altitude without six exceeding 380 on the number five. And that's arbitrary, but it's, I think, somewhat important because it reminds yourself that you're paying attention to it. Under no circumstances should you let it get above 400. And by the way, when you level off at any altitude, uh, we get 832 in a high altitude cruise, you're going to see 380 on that hottest cylinder, the number 5. 6755 Romeo at 9000. So, Romeo, Miami Center, Baby Shell, Any attempt to keep that temperature at or slightly below 380 is, uh, uh, a, I believe, an honorable attempt. And uh, should be uh, should be continued. That this one is a little persnickety in that regard. So we got 34 gallons to hold that number five at 384 at a cruise climb 35 uh, 35 inches. That's a bit marginal, and I suspect maybe a small, tiny induction leak. Uh, so. You know, it's it's workable, it's within standards, but worthy of watching. Dick Rochford flies safely. Train off it.